Yes team, what's going on? Welcome back to another video. I haven't actually picked up the camera in what feels like forever. Since Centre Parks, I've been super busy. Since getting back from Centre Parks, it's been the end of the month. Lots of computer work, lots of invoicing, all that jazz. Um, and just had quite a lot on, quite a lot of editing stuff to do. So I haven't been able to pick up the camera and film. So I've decided I've not really got anything special on. I've just mid then we've just finished personal training and we're finished for the day. So I'm gonna film sort of today, the rest of the week. And just because I've been miss, missed a bit of this relationship, missed a bit of filming. So sit back, relax, enjoy the video and make sure you leave it a thumbs up. Yeah. All right, so we are en route to the gym. I have good, good little surprise this morning. I found this one bar in my cupboard within all the protein bars that I do have, and I've got this in America. This is a uh, chocolate chip cookie dough, and I haven't had this yet, so we're bringing back the protein review. Let's have a little dabble on it. That's the worst one bar so far. If you remember, we did the American one bar reviews. That's the worst one of the lot. Right, this week I've also been hitting my one rep max. I've been bulking for about four weeks. Actually, I'm driving. Let me let me see this clip in a minute. Okay then, so like I was saying, I have done, this week I've been testing my maxes. I'm about four weeks into bulking. I've just got back to Centre Park, so I was well rested. So I decided I would test my maxes and see where my strength's at. So I did my deadlift on first day back. I think I pulled 170, I'll put a clip in. Then we did squats two days ago. I hit a 140 and now today is bench day. So I'm gonna show you a few highlights of my chest day. We're back with Johnny Mayo. He's back from ship for three months. He's gonna be my training partner for the next three months, which I'm buzzing about because when he's here, he's similar standard to me. So it helps motivate me. I push him, he pushes me, vice versa. What a tune, catch you in a bit. See you in the gym. So we're back with Jay Mayo. I am. You've been on the channel for since last year. Months, mate. So he's lost all his games. Nah, it's really. Um, we won't even hit any PR today in terms of, obviously we're one month back in the strength training, so yeah, I'm not as strong as I used to be. But we're just setting these markers so that as we're growing in strength training and programming, we know we're progressing, we know we're getting stronger. So yeah. We're warming up for this bench press single. I'm hoping to be honest for a 105. Let's see how we go. Okay, while we're on the topic of singles, I thought it might be quite a good idea to touch on sort of how we approach our singles, so like the rep ranges leading up to that point. So you normally, obviously you need to make sure you're warm, fully warmed up. Jay did a little bit of cardio. I just did lots of band work and some uh, plate work opening uh, the shoulders and the rotator cuffs. And from there, once we actually hit the bench, I do 20 for about a set, just warming up, feeling that movement. 40 for a set, 60 for a set. And then reps can be anything between 10, 6, in sort of that range, but I'm just getting the blood flow warm, just getting warmed up. Once we're at that stage, is then when I drop the reps down. So you've got a set of 80 there, four reps. I'll now go, everything above that will just be for a single. And that will be as if I'm hitting my heavy PR. So I'll sit up really tight and yeah, just hit singles from there. So probably go 90, 100, hopefully a 105. Nice to Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay then guys, not ideal. We ran out of battery in the gym. So I couldn't show you my full highlights, but that was a wicked push day. Probably one of the best push days I've had in that new gym. Uh, what did we get up to? We got up to a 105 for a single. Really happy how that moved. And then I actually did go for a PR of 110. It would have been a PR because when I hit my last 110, I was about, about 80 kilos. Today, I'm around 77, so it would have been a PR. We got close, we didn't quite get it, but I felt good in the gym, that pre-workout hit me hard and yeah, it was just really good. So it's no, it's nice to know that I'm only a month into bulking and my strength on bench is pretty similar to where it should be pre-cut. So it means that I didn't lose too, lose too much strength through that cut. So my plan now is now that I know my strength numbers, try and work and improve and get those numbers up. Right, the game plan for the rest of the day is I've just got the Center Parks video live or waiting to go live and now my good mate Skillsy Gilsey is just in the process of moving into his house and we yesterday went to fit the defences and what else did we do? Oh, some decking. So we need to go finish that, so let's spin there, see how our progress is looking. Yes, like, like yesterday was an absolute nightmare, we were like dumb and dumber trying to get that, that done but yeah, let's see how we're getting on. Okay then team, we are here, Skillsy Gilsey's garden, Peter, he's actually smashed it so they put up that fence last weekend, yesterday we did the solid on that one, J Mail, AP who's an absolute ghost in the sun, adds that's not doing you any favours, oh. <laughs> it's blinding, uh, we're knocking up the rubble there. And then this, let me get out of the way, is soon to be decking. So, let's insert a time lapse right here of us being sick guys building some decking. Also, Pete's done us a solid. What? Frozen pieces, man. Beauty. <laughs> Listen to the sound. That's good. That's how far we got with the decking. Do not employ us, because it, it will look tidy when it's done. But it took a long time, didn't it, Skills? That was the nightmare to go around the drain. But I think I'm gonna come back and help Pete out tomorrow for an hour and a half and bosh out the rest of that national flyby. So let's, uh, we'll fast forward to tomorrow and see if we get any further. 24 hours later, we're back. Just me and Skills tonight and Jasmine, she's doing the inside. This is the progression. Doesn't look like much, but I tell you, it's taken some time. We've had some dirty edges there. We'll do a bit more underneath. But now I've actually got to go. We will shoot to work. So the reason why we're doing this is Pete and Jasmine are having a gathering on the weekend for like moving in. But we're there leaving it pretty fine. So I suppose I'm going to carry on the vlog until Saturday and let's see if this gets done. It's a little bit later in the evening. Oh, wobbly camera. Just finished work. Come home to this package. Well, I'm a little bit gassed about this package, if I think here it is. So, PhD Nutrition logo. They got in contact with me on Instagram and just said, look Riley, do you want some free stuff? I was like, PhD? Yes, I do. I'm guessing that this is the free stuff. They have sent me out three of their protein shakes to try out. Macros on these bad boys per shake about 10 grams of fat per shake low carb With about six grams per shake and 20 grams of protein So over the next few days, we'll be trying these out testing them out shout out to BHD for sending me out These it's the first proper company that sent me stuff. So a little bit buzzing with that. Happy days Yes team what's cracking welcome to Friday I'm putting it out there, it's probably the hottest day of the year today. It's absolutely roasting. I've just finished work, 
and we are going team paddleboarding. So Al has got a load of people from the studio together. Uh, we're going to do this paddleboarding. We've got two hours of paddleboarding and then a barbecue evening that they're going to put on for us. So that's going to be wicked. So I thought we can't miss out. I'm going to try and film as much as I can. Probably even take the drone up. I've got a GoPro. I'm all prepared. Let's try and get some good footage. Beth's going to be there. It should be a good, good evening. So let's continue on this vlog. Let's see if we can get some good footage. Not a way up. No one's sleeping on me, baby. Stay up. Been a minute since I had you in my old style, bro style. Dry the lane, we should lay up like all day, all night, all day. Or the Japanese in bed. I'm down with the rope. Lay down with you, always coming for me. Stay forever, don't you ever leave. So won't you lay me? Won't you lay me down? Won't you lay me? Won't you? Wake up with a fresh press and a crossword. One down, but I digress. Poached eggs in my finest. Robe never tied this. Lounge wear leisure. Like Paddleboarding success. That was good it from you. You put that on all right, didn't you? Yeah. So For once, Mark, he's done something right, hasn't he? <laughs> <laughs> no, that was really good. So I'll set it up. Mark, the owner of Enjoy. Uh, we decided that we'd bring loads of our clients here. Really, really good little vlog. Two hours. Eight, 18 people turn up, is not it? Yeah, two hours on the water. Just so it's said, no absolutely barbecue. help yourself like, to anything you need, like seats or if you need anything, like, give a shout, right? So, now it's chills and barbecue. It is a few days later. We're here wrapping up the video. So there's some sort of paddleboarding, and paddleboarding was absolutely wicked. It was a company called We Slop that we got in contact with. And we went and just put an event on there and basically took all of our clients, some of our clients down, just a few hours of paddle boarded on the river and then they sort of let the bar, they put a barbie out and they said like sort of, you do your thing on the barbie, you stay as late as you want, you can have a few beers, blah blah blah, blah. It's absolutely a awesome event and, and the guys at We Top, probably what made that, uh, they were just so funny, easy going, proper sound lads, so yeah, I'm actually going to get in contact with them again and try and organise some more things like that because it was really, really good. Fair play to Al for putting it on and organising it because, yeah, it was really, really successful, so that was good. Uh, I'm going to wrap up the video here. We've got the Centre Parks crew coming around in a minute to plan uh, some bits and bobs for when we go. And, uh, yeah, that's about it. So I'm going to wrap up the video. I've got a filming job this afternoon. I'm going to try and get this out as soon as possible. So if you enjoyed this video, you know what to do. Like it, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I'll see you in a bit.